Hey, what's up, Madden people? Crazy Hot Boy E here. The E is for Edwin coming to you with another video. So, if you got 100k coins or less, please stay tuned and watch this. I'm going to show you what you can do to make some coins. I know I got 3 million, but you can definitely get your coins up with 100k or less, no problem. And if you do like the content, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and leave a like for me. And you can definitely comment what your favorite player it is, and we might just do it in a giveaway on stream. So, the packs we're going to be in is the 500 pack. 500 get a silver pack We're gonna go ahead. I'm gonna show you exactly what to do with every card that you pull By going through this video. So as you can see we pull the card there. We're going to put it into the set We pull the 71 here What we're gonna do is we're gonna put that into the gold harvest set and I'm gonna show you exactly why we're putting that into the gold harvest set All right next one here we pull a superstar we get an 84 all right, so we're just gonna hold that and the binder right now so we spent three packs right now and we're down 1500 coins but remember we got the 84 superstar in our binder so we get another card there that's 2000 coins we're down we put that into the set and then we're almost done with that set and now we buy another 500 player pack here and we are going to get a gold this time a 70 gold now usually i put this into the set but i already got my harvest player used up so we're just going to go ahead and we're going to quick sell this one or you can put this to the 75, 79 set, either way that you want to do it. All right, but that's 2,500 coins. We're down now, and we're going on to the next set here. And this is 67, so we're going to go ahead and put that to the set as well, too. All right, so that's 3,000. Right here now, we're at 3,000, and we pull the gold here. We pull a 75. All right, so we're going to go ahead and put that into the gold harvest set. So put that in the harvest. All right, let's go ahead and just back out. And remember, we spent 3,3500 3, coins right now. Uh, I can't remember, was it 3,3500? 3, but it was either one of those. We pull this gold harvest card. All right, cool. So right now, we're just down 3,000 coins. And we're about to go to our binder, and we're going to do a little quick cash out. We're going to supplement our income right now. So this is what we're doing. So we're going to go over to the newest. And then we're going to go to Philip Lindsay. All right, that's going for 3,900 coins. So basically for all those packs we just opened, we just made our coins back. And we're going to go over and put them up for auction for the Jalen Mills, which we got from the Gold Harvest set. We're going to click on that one. And this is 2,700 coins. And everybody doing a set because of the new Odell Beckham. They got to get that card. So this is definitely going to stay profitable. So we're going to put that up for 2,500 coins. And we just made coins to re-roll for another round for the silver packs. Now, the reason why you want to do the silver packs is because Cam Newton, Darren Waller, Lamar Jackson, um, some other power, a handful of other power players, they're all in packs. And they all go for a lot of coins right now. As we get an 84 overall locket. That Cam Newton is going for 100, 120,000 coins. Um, Darren Wall is going for 100K. Lamar Jackson is going for a good amount. And so we're going to, we held on to that locket. We're going to put that 65 into the set. And we get the 66, 69. We're going to hope for a power up. And we don't get the power up, but we do get a silver card. We're going to throw that into the set as well, too. So once you get the 74, 70 gold change of set, and we got a power up there. All right, we got an AJ Green power up, so that might be going for something. So we got our 2,200 coins there, and we got our other card is going to sell too. So we're pretty much we're only down a little bit right now without the stuff selling, but we're going to come back over here and see what AJ Green is going for and see what Lockett is going for. Lockett is going for 3,500 as well too. All right, so we only opened like three three packs and we just made another 3,000 coins, so we're up right there. And then AJ Green, we pulled from the power up. He is going for 4,100, 3,100. That's a snipe, kind of snipe right there. We're going to go ahead and put him up for 42. And he's definitely going to sell because AJ Green just got a new draft card. So he was the number two or number three pick or number four pick. So he got that 97 draft card. So you know that's going to sell even if you put it up for a little bit higher of amount. And then you just go back over to the store, and I'm going to show you what to do with the rest of the cards that you're doing. So all you got to do is follow this, um, and I'll show you exactly what to do. So we get a power-up first rip there. 
we get a Jordan Reed, which is not going for much at all. I don't think, I don't believe he got any new upgrades. So if we would have hit a 68 Lamar, that would have been nice. Or a 68 Waller, but that's totally okay. We got to go there. That's why we're pulling the packs. We're going to go ahead and put that into the harvest. All right. And we come back to the get a player pack silvers. We are 67. We're going to put that into the 70 74 set. All right. We're going to do it again. So this is all you have to do. If you pull a 78 or a 79 and it doesn't go into the harvest set, just go ahead and quick sell it. As we get a 70 right there. So before we quick sell this for training, this time we're just going to put it into the 75 79 set. As we get a 75 79 right there. And we get a 75. So we're going to go ahead and put that in the harvest set. If we were to pull the 78 or a 79, we would have just quick sold it for training. But since there's a 75, we put that in the set and we go ahead and take the coins from that. So that's another 2,700 coins. Don't even got to think about it. You just throw him up on the auction house, don't got to check the pricing, and you're good to go. So this is all you want to do, rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat. So your training stack is going to go up, your coin stack is going to go up. It may start off at first where it looks like you're going down, but that's probably only in the first, like, 5, 10 minutes. Unless you hit a really bad dry spell, as you see that Case Kingdom sold already. Um, but chances are you're not going to hit that bad of a dry spell, you're going to pull some elites. So you're definitely going to make your coins back and be at a profit from the set. All right, so we got the 65 there, so we put that into the set. I'm gonna just keep showing you what to do with every single card once you get it, guys. As we get a gold here, we get a 72. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and put that in the gold harvest set. So all we need now is a 75 to 79 to put in the gold harvest set, and then we can stop it. We can check in for the Jordan Reed, see what that's going for, and we get a 67 there. We put that into the set, and we go ahead and see what we get out of the 70-74 pack. We get a power-up, and it's a Mitchell short. So I don't think that's going for much. Maybe like 2,000, 3,000 coins. But we'll just go ahead and double-check to see if we made any profit with these power-ups. This is all you want to do. So if, you, if your new power-up that comes out, if they got a new card, chances are they're going to be going for a decent amount. And you'll at least be able to supplement so you hit a Cam or hit a Lamar. Yeah, he's going for 1,800 coins, and then Jordan Reed is going for, I don't think a lot at all. Yeah, he's going for 700 coins. All right, so basically this is all you're doing, guys, for the low coin method. I'm going to keep doing it just to show you exactly, so you have a feel for it just a little bit longer. If you need a, um, a medium coin method, I have those as well, too. Um, I released a video earlier today. I did a stream on it. It's the theme diamond sets. You can definitely do those, and if you need a Bitcoin stack, you can always do the Color Smash set if you have a Bitcoin stack and you want to make um, some profit doing a new Color Smash Exchange set that came out um, yesterday. So, back to the silver packs here. We get a 70, 68. We're going to put that into the set. All right. Next one here. We got a gold player. We got a 73, so we're gonna put that in the harvest. We can't put into the harvest. We're just gonna go ahead and quick sell it for training. All right, and next card here. We got a silver. We got a 67 silver, we put that into the set. Another 70, 74. You want a power up out of these, just uh, a power up that may go for a little bit more. As we get a 74, a 74 is fine as well, too. We go ahead and sell 74s and 73s. We just go ahead and quick sell them. For training, you can't put them on an auction house for about 700 coins, 600 coins. But you might as well just take the training from that. It's no big deal. All right, and then the 66, we go ahead and put that into the set. All right, and we get another silver here. We get a 67 Gabe Bright. We're going to put that into the set. And as you can see, we put the AJ Green up for 4,200 coins. There was one for 3,100. And it's sold, like, literally in, like, a minute or two. As we get a playoff card here, so, boom, instant profit right there. That's another 3,000, 4,000 coins. So that basically we just supplement all the packs I can do until I can pull one of those big cards, one of those big power-ups that goes for a lot of coins. All right, we put the 67 into the set here. 
And we get another 70 74. All right, we got a Jason Wood in that time. I'm just going to go ahead and quick sell that for coins. And we're going to do this for a little longer, just in case you need a little bit more explanations to see what to do. We get a silver here. We put that into the set as our Mitchell Swartz went ahead and sell. So as you can see, you're going to be buying packs. Some coins are going to be coming in. As long as you check, when you when you think you got a big pull, just pull away. Go to your item binder and see if they, it's a big pull. If it's not, you can sell the card. If it is, you can definitely sell the card as well, too. Um, so either way it goes, you're selling as we pull the gold harvest there. That, we automatically know what it's going for. So we just go ahead to the auction, and we throw it right back up on the auction house. 2,400 coins. That's going to sell fast. Watch. All right, almost bought the wrong pack there, but we get back to the silver player packs here. We got a power up. 69 Kareem Jackson, that's absolute trash. As the visual sells are already, it literally sold in about 30 seconds, guys. So if you get in the 78, so the 75 through 79s, definitely put them in the gold harvest. Put your low 70, 74s in the gold harvest, and you're good to go. As we get a 66 to 69 pack here, hopefully we get a power up. And we don't, which is totally fine. We get a 66. Put that into the set. All right, so I think you guys get the gist of it. So 66 or 60 and belows you put into the set to hope to pull a new power up. 70, 71s you put into the gold harvest. 73, 74 you quick sell. 75, 76 you put into the gold harvest. Uh, 77 through 79 you quick sell for training. Any elites you get, you go ahead and sell on the auction house right away for more coins. And this is basically the set. So we're going to keep going here until we get a power up as we get a silver there. Uh, we just throw that into the 66-69 set. All right, and we get an exchange pack here. We get another silver. We get a 69 Vince Mayo. That's not what we're looking for. We put that into the set. We get a 70-74. And we're going to get a power-up, so we'll stop here. We get a 74 Jason Seahorn. Not sure what he's going for, but I don't know. I do know he has a limited time serious redux, so you just always want to check to see what these guys are going for. And I'm going to show you some of my auctions that I've been doing. So we got Tyler Lockett, 3,000. Philip Lindsay, 3,000. We have a Michael Burden, 6,600. Uh, 88 Williams. Uh, an, an 88 Mac for 9,800. So yeah, we've been doing this, and we turned into a, our middle age set. If you need to see that video on my middle profit set, I mean, you can go back and check that. If you have a million coins or less, you can definitely do that set. If you have 100k or less, just do this set, and you'll be good to go. So thanks for watching. Have a good day. Be better tomorrow. Go ahead and subscribe, and you guys have a great day.